Good morning, friends. This is day 30 of our 40 days of praying for the reviving of our experience with God. Today we are continuing to look at God, uh, our fourth watch God. Um, Psalm 46 verse 10 says, Be still and know that I am God. I will be exalted in the nations. I will be exalted on the earth. God is calling us to, to come into a deeper, more intimate, more genuine relationship with him. And one of the ways in which he invites us or he, he brings us into that deeper experience with him is uh, through the trials, the difficult times, the brokenness, uh, the storms in our lives. And so while we we have no desire no you know to to really be found in difficult situations um from past experience we we can see how these situations in the past has has shaped us into who we are today um into uh, even to where we are um, at this given point in time and so he asks, asks us to look in the midst of a storm, be still and know that I am God. Um, we see the same be still um, being used in Exodus 14 verse 13 when um, the children of the Hebrew people had just come out of Egypt. And, um, and even though Pharaoh had told them to, to go ahead, uh, he began to pursue after them, and so they find themselves trapped be between Pharaoh and his army and the Red Sea. And, and so Moses, again, God uses Moses at the very last minute to, to say, um, be still and see the salvation of the Lord. And, and so this, again, at the, the last minute, they're, they're found in a situation where there's nowhere else to turn, and, and so... He says, be still. So when you are faced with storms in your lives, just like, like Jesus was able to, to calm that storm that the disciples found themselves in by saying to, to the, the sea and the wind and the waves, be still, be quiet. Um, he is encouraging us um, to be still as well to not be worried, to not be complaining and fretting like we, we are most inclined to do when we find ourselves in challenging situations. So be intentional about your being still. Um, make sure that you pray for the infilling of the Holy Spirit because I believe that the only way we can truly be still is... Um, by the power of the Holy Spirit. So make sure you are asking for that again today. May God bless you as you do so.